Hey, welcome everyone to our Essential Oils 101 class. Um, I'm Stacy Cook, and tonight I am here with Sherry Placco and Wendy Chapman and Vanessa Yultsen, and we are super excited to share with you uh, some basics of essential oil usage. We're going to give you um, all the information you need to know to safely and effectively use oils. Plus, you're going to hear about some really great ways that you can use oils to swap out some of the things you use in your home. And that's really one of the big keys here, because um, for me, I started this whole journey with essential oils around seven years ago, and it was really to get just some synthetic fragrance products out of my home, because those are so packed with toxic chemicals that cause um, massive issues for our endocrine system. Um, they have carcinogens, they have all types of toxic garbage in them. And when we use them and it accumulates in our body, it can have some really negative impacts. So Vanessa is going to talk more a bit about um, some ditch and switch stuff. So I'm not gonna get too into that right now. But I just want you to know that that information is coming. And um, it's really, really valuable. So if you have some notepad, and you want to take some notes, that's a great idea. Um, and then we're also going to share with you uh, how you can get oils, the easiest way to order them because you have a few different options and we've been doing this a while so we can help you um, make sure that you're doing it the best way. Um, so uh, you're really lucky tonight because I am not technically a teacher. While I have been using oils for about seven years and I have a lot of experience with them and how they've impacted me and my family, um, I do not teach for a living. However, the other three ladies who are going to speak tonight do teach for a living. So you're in for a treat because they're really good at explaining things really well. Um, so first you get me. Um, and I <laughs> am going to share with you um, what exactly are essential oils, right? So essential oils are uh, the, the liquids extracted from plants, right? They're what we call the lifeblood of plants. They are essentially um, the essence of plants. And the way that they're extracted from the plants is typically through steam distillation. Um, and so the essential oil is the protective and defense system of the plants. So when we use them, we get some of those protective properties. Uh, so that's why um, they are so powerful. They're very concentrated. And essential oils are not greasy. So they're not like, um, you know, coconut oil or olive oil. Um, when you put them on your skin, they're absorbed into your skin or they evaporate off of your skin. They're um, what we call volatile. So um, they're not a greasy oil. And um, one of the really key things when you're looking at essential oils is understanding where they're coming from. So that's why all the essential oils we're going to talk about tonight and any product, because there are some things outside of essential oils that we're going to touch on um, that are super helpful to have in your home. And um, they're all from Young Living. And the reason that um, we've all chosen Young Living as our essential oil of choice is because um, one, they've been around the longest. So Young Living is over 25 years old. They're really um, the originator of essential oil distillation in the United States. Gary Young is the founder of Young Living and um, he really pioneered it. So uh, they've been around forever. They know what they're doing. They do it really well. Their testing is above and beyond anything you could ever even imagine. The amount of testing that goes into each batch of essential oil is um, like in triplicate and then done again. It's, it's, it's off the wall, honestly. Um, <laughs> and um, what's really unique about Young Living is that they own their own farms and they certify their own partner farms. So they have this connection from the time that they source that seed until they plant it in the ground, cultivate it, harvest it, bot, you know, distill it, bottle it, everything. All of that is within the confines of Young Living. They call it the seed to seal guarantee um, because they're really able to guarantee the quality of the oil because they have had their hands on it through every single step no other essential oil company can make that claim. Uh, if you call Young Living and you say, hey, I wanna go visit one of your farms, they'll say, hey, that's really cool. This is where you can go and this is when you can go. If you try calling any other essential oil company and say, when can I visit your farm? They will say, you can't because we don't have a farm. We buy our essential oils from farmers. And the truth is they don't know what those farmers are doing, what their practices are. Are they organic? Do they include chemicals? Young Living's um, farming practices uh, no pesticides, no herbicides, all pest management is done using essential oils. They weed by hand. It's really over the top. So um, that is why we choose Young Living. 
Uh, so I'm gonna run you through really quickly. There's three main ways that we can use essential oils. Um, and how you use them is going to kind of depend on why you're using them. So we can use our essential oils topically. We can, you know, we can take a drop of oil, drop it in your hand, rub it on your body, and we get the oils and the benefits through our skin. We all know, right, that our skin is our largest organ. And while we think of it as this protective covering, it's actually this conduit into our body, which is why it's so important that the things we put on it are clean and don't have chemicals in them, right? So that's how we can get the benefits of essential oils topically. When we use our oils topically, a lot of the times we'll do it with a carrier oil. So we'll use like a fatty oil, like a coconut oil or an olive oil to help dilute it. That also gives it a little bit more staying power on our skin. Um, we can also use our oils aromatically. So don't have a diffuser within reach of me. <laughs> there you go. Sherry's showing you a diffuser. Um, so uh, we can diffuse our oils and that is how we get those essential oil molecules into the air. We breathe them in and we can get the benefits that way. Um, diffusing is great for emotional support. Like if you're stressed out or if you need help sleeping, just having that diffuser going near you or even just for clearing the air, air in your home. And the girls are gonna talk more about some specific oils you can use for all those things. Um, and then you can use the oils internally. Now, please, 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 please. When we talk about using oils internally, really for anything, but internally, especially, I am only talking about Young Living Oils. Do not go see some bargain oils at TJ Maxx and pick them up and be like, oh, I heard I can put this lemon in my water. Not that lemon, um, only Young Living, because we know it's pure. We know that there is nothing else in that bottle other than pure essential oil. Um, but you can take our oils internally. So I actually love lemon in my water. Um, you can uh, take them internally, you could add them to water, or you can even use little like veggie capsules. If you've ever seen at the health food store, they're little like um, veggie cellulose or gelatin capsules, empty capsules. You can open up, put some drops of oil in there, close them up and take them that way. I take a few that way every day. Um, and they're amazing. So those are the three ways that we can use our oils. And Vanessa is gonna give us some more ideas on uh, some ditch and switch items we can do. Thanks, Stacey. Um, my name is Vanessa Olson, and I have been a Young Living member since 2019. Um, I love my Young Living products. I use them all the time. And so we're going to talk about a couple quick things. Um, first of all, I use my Young Living products to switch out some of the products that I used to use in my home that we now know are dangerous, harmful. You know, Stacy talked a little bit about just, you know, um, artificial fragrances. Um, other chemicals, parabens, phthalates, SLS, look those things up and that none of them are good for you, yet all of them are found in a ton of your household products, whether it's things you're using on your household surfaces or if it's things that you're using you know, on your body, in your body, et cetera. So um, one of the first things we're just gonna kind of, you'll hear us use the term ditch and switch as we go through this evening a little bit. So what we're talking about there is making some healthier choices for our homes and our families using products that we know um, have pure ingredients that are plant-based, um, that are just all around better for our bodies and our environments in general. Um, so you'll hear us, you know, we'll talk about you can ditch and switch for this. Um, I love my Young Living products. I started with oils. Um, since then I have branched like way, way out. Um, I use Young Living for um, cleaning and that, right, like, Thieves household cleaner, you'll hear, um, you'll hear Sherry talk a little bit later about thieves and that. So, you know, we incorporate that into our cleaning products, um, personal care products and that shampoos. Um, like we could do a whole separate call just on the items you ditch and switch with, um, but just be aware and that, that we're gonna chat about these oils today, but there's so much more out there as well. So I'm gonna talk with you about um, four essential oils that I use on a very, very regular basis. These are the ones for relax and sleep. Like Stacy mentioned, um, I like Sherry and like Wendy, um, I am a full-time teacher. And that, so my day, you know, starts hitting the ground running. I'm working with middle school and high school kids all day long. And, you know, we come home and that there's, you know, dinner and dishes and, you know, just your household stuff. By the time my day is done, being able to like get bring myself back down and actually relax and get good sleep, and that 
isn't always the easiest thing to do. And that yet I know sleep is so incredibly important for my body. Um, so I use a lot of the oils that um, you'll see kind of here on Sherry's screen. And that I use these quite a bit for that chill out, that relaxation, that preparing my body for that restorative sleep that I need so I can get up and do it all again tomorrow. Um, so let me get to those. The first one that you're gonna see there is Peace and Calming. And that Peace and Calming is one of Young Living's oil blends. And that I've said this before, I'll say it again. I love Young Living blends because they are an amazing bang for your buck. And that I've always been somewhat budget conscious um, so anytime you can take a whole bunch of really good stuff and that put it together in one place for me and that, you know, kind of give me that easy button so that I don't have to try to grab six or seven different things, you know, and dump them in my diffuser, um, I'm all in. I'm in. And that, so Peace and Calming is one of those blends. Um, this one is fantastic. And that for high stress situations, and that when you just need to be able to refocus and recenter because you've been, you know, crazy everything around you, um, this particular blend has um, a couple different citrus oils in it. And those citrus oils in general are very uplifting, and that they tend to be able to help kind of pick up and brighten your mood a little bit too. Um, we also have ylang ylang, um, patchouli in there, and blue tansy. So. Um, Tangerine orange, yeah, ylang ylang, patchouli, blue tansy, and that all together, like, you know, right, super awesome. Love me some peace and calming. And that, right, this is definitely our chill oil. Um, similar, and that to that, and that is Stress Away. Okay. Um, this one is a favorite in my diffuser. So Sherry showed you her diffuser a little bit earlier. Um, I love to diffuse at night. And that if I could say that there's one time every single day, no matter how busy and crazy it's been that I know I'm using my oils in my diffuser, it's I set my diffuser up every night before bed and it runs right next to me. Um, Stress Away is a great one for either bedtime or for the evening. Um, those of you with young kids that, you know, after the kids have gone to bed and, you know, need that time to just sort of be able to like decompress from your day. Um, stress away is awesome and that it's a little bit of a vacation in a bottle and that we've got um, again a little bit of citrus in here so we've got some lime oil in this one um, we also have there's a whole again it's another blend super power packed with a lot of great stuff in one place um, copaiba lime cedarwood vanilla akatea lavender um, all in one blend so again, instead of you know six different oils to put in my diffuser, I grab one bottle, throw a few drops in, voila. And that like instant like chill out. And that right now in Chicago, it is snowy and wintry. And that's so when I wanna think of like, you know, warmer tropical places and that this is my vacation. <laughs> okay. Um, the next one that I have and that I will admit and that if you made me like absolutely forced me to choose one young living oil that I could have for the rest of my life. Um, lavender is it. And that I love this oil. And that this is, you know, I had to say like the one oil that I guarantee you I use every single day. And that it's lavender. And this goes in my diffuser every single night. I may throw a couple other things in there with it, depending on my mood. And that, but this is the basis for my sleep blend in my diffuser every night and that so like again lavender calming you know there's plenty of you know candles out there using fake lavender fragrance and that there's all sorts of like other bath products that use lavender fragrance in it and that because we know that lavender just smells calming and that so rather than you know going to grab your bath and body works candle or you know your you know lavender scented whatever and that we go right to the source and that and we actually get the oil from the plant grown on the farm and that for us okay. um, lavender's got a ton of other uses as well like i said this is definitely my go-to 100 percent of the time oil um, but sleep and relaxation and that lavender is pretty much the bomb and that love it um, when we're talking about grounding and that another one of our great big time favorite oils um, is frankincense. Um, I will admit I've had my frankincense around. I've used it here and there. Um, I became like a major frankincense believer a couple months ago. 
and that one of our friends on our team um, puts a roller bottle on the top of her frankincense and like franks her face every single day. And that, so we did a challenge and that back in end of August through September. And I was like, all right, I'm in. And that, so my frankincense with a carrier oil, like Stacy mentioned, um, and I use mine primarily at night. So part of my nighttime routine is I wash my face, I apply a toner, um, and then I would apply my frankincense roller. Um, at first I was like, oh, you know, because it's just so great for my skin, which it totally is. The benefit that I got that I didn't realize I was gonna be getting, and that is the fact that just the smell of this oil on my skin at night as I'm getting ready for bed, and that just super calming, very grounding, um, really allows me to kind of calm my mind. And that again, you know, moms, especially you guys know that when we lay down our brains tend to ping pong in 20 directions and that frankincense is great for helping to quiet that. Um, so I am all about my relaxing, my calming and that my chill out oils and right, these definitely are four of my favorites. And then I think I'm passing it off to Wendy next. And then she's going to talk about a few more. Hi, you guys. Thanks, Vanessa. I love hearing all the stuff, how you use your oils. Um, Vanessa and I are on the cheerleading squad for lavender because we absolutely adore it. Um, it's one of my most favorites, too. Um, definitely as a single, for sure. Okay, well, you guys, going further into the dish and switch, we are going to talk about um, four more, actually five more. And these are um, uh, in utilizing them. So when I switched out a lot of my products in my house, I got rid of a lot of products that we would use on our skin. First one I'm going to tell you guys about is Panaway. Now, um, as a young, when I was younger, when I, my kids were younger and I was nursing, I always had really bad upper back and neck problems. And so I always used to use some other not so great muscle rubs. And I had to be really careful not to let my kids touch them and what have you, you know, which is kind of hard when you're holding babies and everything. Well, in comes Panaway. Oh my goodness gracious. This one is amazing. This one is amazing for um, all things muscle. Okay. All things tension, I should say. All right. This one has something um, called methyl salicylate, and this is from Wintergreen. Now, a lot of other muscle rubs pull out, um, they actually make synthetic versions of the methyl salicylate, I'm totally botching this, salicylate, um, but we, or Young Living, I should say, uses it from Wintergreen, and it's amazingly powerful, you guys. This is the go-to to keep in your gym bag. This goes on my head tension areas. This goes on my upper neck tension areas. It's for everything and anything that you can say ouch and ow to. So that's an amazing one to bring into your house. And it smells amazing. It's really nice and clear and clean. It has wintergreen, helichrysum, clove, and peppermint. All of those are amazing for um, calming stressed out muscles. All right. Um, the next one I want to tell you guys about is Raven. Now, Raven is amazing. And this one, you can see that it's right next to a diffuser. This one can be put on your body or put in the diffuser, okay, on your body, um, like on your chest. So this one is all things respiratory, okay? So I have a little chat, like a chant that I always tell people. And I say, chest, feet, diffuse, repeat. So Whenever you're not feeling well, you're going to have to put something on consistently and oils you aren't just like taking a Motrin or something that you take it every six hours, right? You're going to have to um, put these on consistent. So um, whenever I'm not feeling well, I will put this on every hour. Okay, on my chest, I'll put it on my back, my kids, if it's, if it's them, I can get their chest and I can get their front and their back. Right, and I'm gonna put it on the in the diffuser, and I'm gonna put that diffuser pretty near me. I want it, I want to be able to breathe that air in. Okay, I don't want it across the room, I want it near me because I'm going for some health here. Okay. Whoop. And okay, so again, chest, feet, um, diffuser, repeat. Okay, so you got to keep doing it. So if I'm sick, I put it on every hour. If I'm kind of feeling funky, like I'm a teacher as well. And sometimes I'll come home and I'll just be like, well, 
I don't know, I just kind of feel something. Then I'll put it on two to three times a day. And then otherwise, if I'm feeling great, I put it on every like day. Well, I should say my thieves I put on every day. I'm going to tell you guys about that in a second. Um, my raven I'll use whenever I need. Um, I was confusing my thieves and my raven there for a second, guys. Sorry about that. Um, my raven is really great just for um, opening up your airways. Um, it has Ravensara, which in Madagascar, they called it the healing oil, okay? Ravensara, if you guys just look that one up, it's amazing and it's super duper healing. It also has lemon, wintergreen, peppermint, and eucalyptus radiata. So from those, you can tell that it's a really opening, it opens up your airways and, and it helps you to breathe deeper. So it's a great one to have, all right? Next, I'm going to tell you guys about Thieves. Now, Thieves is like one of my all-time favorites, okay? And you guys can see that up on your screen, you have a little white bottle. I can't see me on the screen, so I don't know. I don't know what you guys can see from me. But here's the Thieves white bottle. And then we also have Thieves with the brown label, okay? So one you can take internally and one you um, can put in your diffuser and you can put it on your body. They're the exact same oil, okay? exact same oil. Um, FDA just likes to have a little white label on to say the one that you can take internally. All right. So this one is amazing. So this one is like replaced all of our cold medicines. Okay. Everything that had to do with health and wellness, these, this oil replaced everything. So, um, we put it in capsules, we put it in roller bottles. You guys can see um, there's a little roller bottle here that I have that um, in your little kit that we're telling you guys about, you get a little roller cap. And this is just one of the little bottles that I've actually just reused. Okay, same size, I just pop it on there and I roll this anywhere I am not feeling right. Okay, maybe it's my neck, maybe it's my chest. Um, and I like to put it on again every hour if I'm not feeling well, if I'm feeling just a little funky, it's two to three times a day. But every day I use this for wellness. And so I put this on my feet and my neck, chest area every single night, every night. All right. I also like making this into, I put a little spray bottle here and it makes a nice little throat spray because I teach all the time and I don't chew gum while I'm teaching. And so it like moistens your mouth and um, it keeps all the cooties away. <laughs> okay. That's a great way to put it. All right. Um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. So consistency is the key though with our thieves. Okay. So if you're not feeling well, you're going to have to get keep putting this into your body. And it's amazing. We love putting this in capsules. And like I said, spray. So I'll put a capsule to take it into my body. I'm spraying my, say my throat, if I'm not feeling well, and then I'm rolling it on my body as well and put it on your feet. You guys, your feet are like sponges and they absorb things and we can get, um, the oils into our bodies really, really fast when we put them on our feet. I use a carrier oil too, because it helps with the stain power, like Stacy was saying. They're volatile. And so when you put it on your skin, you want them to go into your skin and stay on your skin. And it's kind of like um, when you put that carrier oil on, it sits on it and it traps it inside your skin. And so it's going to go into your body. Well, it's great to smell it. I want these to go into my body and do a purpose. They don't need to be around me so much. And also Thieves is great in the diffuser. And again, if I'm not feeling well, you guys, that diffuser is right near me. If it's by my kids or if my kids aren't feeling well, I have it right by them. I don't have it across the room, but I have it doing its job. All right, so they're able to breathe all that in and get that goodness in to help bolster their immunity. Okay, all right, that's on it on Thieves. I love that the, she has a, the slide up here. It has a jar of honey. A lot of people like to take a spoonful of honey and put a few drops of Thieves on there. I'll, you could also mix it in with your tea. It's totally your whatever floats your boat. Um, I like rollers. It gets it done and quick and fast. All right. My last one, um, or actually not my last one, my second to last one is the blend that I'm going to tell you about is Digize. Now, Digize is my oil that I would choose to have if I were lost or stranded on a desert island, okay? This is a crazy oil. It is for all things digestion, okay? I have to read my list here because there's a thousand oils in here. Um, it's tarragon, ginger, peppermint, fennel, juniper, patchouli, lemongrass, and anise. 
This is crazy amazing for digestion. Now, this is one that you either love the taste or you hate the taste. I absolutely adore it. And I, I have this multiple times a day. Um, Vanessa, I can tell from her face, does not like this. Okay. Um, I love it. I love pairing this one with peppermint and I make a roller and I put, I put right tummy on it so my people know what to do with it. And I put it on the back of our toilet in our bathroom. And so whenever someone has an upset stomach, they can use this. Um, Marla just mentioned that Digize is good for motion sickness too. Yes, this is a gem when it comes to not feeling well or digestion health. Um, it just is amazing. It helps on so many aspects. And a little, little side note, this is amazing to have as well. If you ever get a bee sting, this stuff is amazing. Um, I've had stings many a times and I just put a drop on and I have no reaction. And you wouldn't even know I got stung had I, unless I actually saw it myself and put this on there. So this one is amazing little gem. Um, this one's great to put into capsules and you can take that. A lot of people don't like the taste. Um, we like to put it in a capsule for my husband doesn't like it. So capsule, one drop peppermint, one drop digize, and he's good to go. So awesome, awesome. All right. And my last oil that I'm going to tell you guys about is one called Valor. All right, this is an amazing one. Um, this is one that I only put on our bodies. I don't, I don't really put Valor in the diffuser, though you could. Sorry, my child is sharpening pencils right next to me. Um, this is a great one to put on the body. So this is like a little dose of courage or confidence, if you will. It helps to calm yourself. If um, I love putting this one on, you're gonna think I'm funny, but on my dog. Okay, she's really anxious and this calms her down. Um, she's amazing, yeah, it works, right? Um, I have this in a roller bottle, you guys can tell. And I use this every night because it's really amazing for sleep. Um, I love the Valor, it's amazing. All right, so this one has black spruce, blue tansy, frank, um, camphor wood, and geranium. There's a really cool blue color on this one. Let me see if I can get this one out of this bottle. This one has um, a constituent in it and it's blue. Can you guys see that color, the blue on there? It's really cool. And it's, it's called um, sh uh, Shamazuline. And it's a cool blue constituent that um, comes from the blue tansy. And it smells amazing, you guys. So one of my super chill pills that I like to use is I mix the peace and calming that Vanessa was telling us about with the Valor and um, it's ultra calming, all right? I have a friend who um, used to have to be put down in his dentist, like he would have to um, pay to be put under for the dentist because he was so freaked out over it. And we made him a roller of this with the blue, with the peace and calming. And that's all he uses now. So pretty cool. It calms you down. All right. Well, I think I'm all set and I'm going to pass this off to Sherry and she's going to tell us some more, some more information. Thanks, Wendy. Um, my name is Sherry Placco and thank you for joining us here today. Um, we've heard so much in such a short time, so I'm going to try to wrap this up for you. Um, both Wendy and Vanessa were talking about how we can use them topically, how we're using them to swap out those store-bought things. You know, like, remember as a kid that Vicks VapoRub? Yeah, Raven, so much nicer, so much better for us. But my jam is really using a lot of these oils internally. So first I wanna talk about lemon. Now, lemon comes in a white label, or in a solid colored label, and I know you've heard it, but I wanna remind you again, if the label is white or yellow, it's the same oil. But this white label says vitality, so that when you're new and just learning, you'll be like, oh, that means I can use it internally. There is nothing done any differently than for the lemon that's in this bottle, okay? Just so you know it. So I use lemon like every day. I use it in all my things. So I always just buy the big one because we use a lot of lemon around here. So why do I use lemon? Um, it's great for your immune system. It really helps, um, you know, like kind of detox your system. It's great for like your lymphs and everything, just it, your circulatory support. 
um, use it in your water. I actually put it in a capsule. Um, think about Goo Gone. Have you guys ever used that for something sticky in your house? Lemon, put a drop of lemon on something sticky. <gasps> it's gone. You don't need to buy all those chemical filled products because you will have an, a full arsenal ready for you with your oils. So lemon vitality, the easiest way is in your water. But just a quick note, all of our citrus oils, um, you have to be very careful when you use them. You have to use glass, ceramic, or stainless steel because the citrus oils will actually break down the plastics and you know plastic is full just made with petrochemicals so then you're actually like eking the petrochemicals into your water and you're drinking it and the whole reason you're using essential oils is to get away from those things so no plastic no plastic with your oils okay um i actually cook with lemon all the time because how many of you have had a recipe that you needed a lemon slice or a little bit of lemon Okay, well, now you've got your lemon, always handy. Another Vitality oil is Citrus Fresh. Citrus Fresh is an amazing oil. I call this sunshine in a bottle. So listen to what's in this. It's got orange, tangerine, grapefruit, lemon, mandarin, and here's the kicker, spearmint. So spearmint works in a similar way in your body as peppermint does. And Wendy was just telling us about that, how it's great for digestion. So if you use this internally, it really just helps your whole body kind of like cleanse and get everything moving and going. Um, it's amazing in the diffuser as well. So this is one of those um, oils that I like to use for all the things. Next up is peppermint. So this peppermint is beyond strong. One drop of our peppermint essential oil is equivalent to how much peppermint you would consume in 26 cups of peppermint tea. That's a lot, right? Um, but this is great for all things digestion. I like to make a little breath spray for myself with just a drop of peppermint and some distilled water and a little mini plastic. I can use plastic for that if it's a BPA-free um, that I keep in my purse. It's great for a cooling spray. It's really great if you're not ready to take an oil internally yet and you've got a bad stomach ache, you can actually roll this on your stomach around your belly button with a carrier oil and it honestly helps relieve your stomach issues. It's amazing. Um, so many great uses for peppermint. I just love how effective it is for you know, everything gut related and digestion, but also when you've got like sinus pressure going on or anything going on up in your head, just open up that bottle of peppermint and take a nice deep breath, just smell it and you're going to feel it just opening everything up. It's so amazing. And then the last thing I wanna talk about is not an oil, but Young Living makes this amazing antioxidant drink called Ninja Red. And I started my oily journey back in 2016, no, 2015. Wow, it's been a while. Um, because I had been diagnosed with an autoimmune and the medications, lots of medications were not making me feel any better. And I knew there had to be something better out there. And that's how I found Young Living. And this Ninja Red drink, um, it's like, it's just full of antioxidants. I call this my daily wellness drink. Um, I teach eight-year-olds for a living. So essentially I work in a Petri dish. I have an autoimmune and I have to tell you genuinely, since I drink this every day, the number of times I've been sick in the last six and seven years, I can count on one hand. Like, honestly, it's amazing. So I just like to always talk about Ninja Red because it is like a staple for me. Um, they sell it in pouches for on the go or in bottles. And I drink two to four ounces every day, especially right now at this time of year in the Chicagoland area where I live. So we've gone a few minutes over and this was a whole lot of information. So what do you do now, right? Here's the cool thing about Young Living. There are a few different ways that you can get started. Now, the best deal if you liked all the oils that you heard about here tonight, 
is still what we call our premium starter kit. And you can see it's you would receive um, this lovely box that would have all 12 oils that were discussed tonight, and it includes a diffuser. And all of this is only $165. So if you bought it all separately, it's over $400. So still the best way to get going. But maybe you're like, you know, I just, I'm not ready for that commitment or I really don't want all those oils. I want to dive more into this thieves line or I've, I heard about the shampoo or I heard about your skincare. Let's talk about how you can get all started. You can order that kit or a hundred PV order. PV, when you look at our website stands for the point value just about everything except diffusers the pv is the same as the price so easy peasy you buy a starter kit or a hundred pv worth of product and you have now unlocked a 24 percent customer discount you're welcome like who doesn't want a discount you don't pay a membership fee like you do at costco you just buy the products you know you want to use um a better way to get started is to order your kit or 100 pv and set something up on a subscribe to save. So many of you have well, you know, boxes come to your house. I know there's Stitch Fix, there's the Fabletics or all of those different subscription boxes. We've got one too. Here's the cool part though. You pick what you want in it and you can have something come to you every one month, every two months or every three months, your choice. But by doing that, you're unlocking a 24% discount. You get free shipping and you're in charge of your health and wellness and what comes into your home all of the time. And then finally, the last way is to place that 100 PV order on subscribe to save. And then you're going to talk to the person that sent you this class so they could help you get started. And then you're going to find out about how to be a brand partner, which is what all of us here on this class tonight were, because we are here to help educate people about essential oils. And we love to share our love and passion about these products and help everybody find that same health and wellness that we have found with Young Living. So I hope that this class has been informative and please reach out to the person that sent you this, um, this link to join us here today or to watch this video later so that they can help you get started. And I hope you have a wonderful evening. Take care, everybody. Thank you. Bye-bye.